Hi, this is Arn Answers back with another session, and this is Five Cures for Chlamydia You Should Know. So what is chlamydia? Chlamydia is a sexually transmitted infection caused by the bacteria Chlamydia tractomitis. Each year, millions of people around the world contract this ubiquitous STD. Chlamydia is the most common STD in the United States. The Centers for Disease Control estimates that around 2.8 million people are infected annually in the United States. Chlamydia is transmitted through oral, anal, and vaginal sex. Chlamydia can also be transmitted from mother to newborn during birth. Chlamydia Symptoms in Men Chlamydia is known as a silent STD. Often there are no outward signs and symptoms associated with a sexually transmitted infection. Men in particular are likely to have no overt symptoms of chlamydia. If there are signs and symptoms present, the most common in men are burning sensation with urination, a tender scrotum, and discharge from the urethra. In the picture to the left, you can see discharge coming out of a male urethra, in case you're wondering what that picture is. Chlamydia symptoms in women. For women, missing the symptoms and signs of chlamydia can have a serious, lasting impression on their fertility. Infertility and pelvic inflammatory disease can result from untreated chlamydia. Common symptoms of chlamydia in women include painful urination, discomfort during sexual intercourse, and unusual vaginal discharge. In both genders, untreated chlamydia may spread to nearby organs of the pelvic region. So who's at risk? Anyone who's sexually active is at risk for getting chlamydia, but there are certain groups of people who are more likely to contract the STD. Teens and young adults, people with multiple sexual partners, and illicit drug users. Cures for chlamydia. Since chlamydia is caused by a bacteria, the sole treatments involve antibiotics. There are a multitude of antibiotics that can cure chlamydia. Luckily, most are affordable and readily available. However, they cannot be obtained over the counter. They require a visit from the doctor for a physical exam and a proper diagnosis. Erythromycin. Taken over seven days, erythromycin is a standard treatment for infants that get chlamydia infections of the eyes during childbirth. Chlamydial eye infections in newborns can lead to blindness, and nausea and vomiting are notable side effects of this medication. Doxycycline. Doxycycline must be taken over a seven-day period, but it works very effectively in killing the chlamydia tractomatis bacteria. Doxycycline is an old drug with a well-known history of working. It is not to be given to pregnant or nursing women. Azithromycin. This medicine is, offers a fast, easy cure for chlamydia. Azithromycin is taken in a single dose of four pills. It's a great option for those in which medication compliance is an issue. Although it's derived from erythromycin, azithromycin has a longer half-life than erythromycin. Common side effects include diarrhea, nausea, and abdominal pain. Amoxicillin. It's chemically related to penicillin, but amoxicillin is used to treat pregnant women who have chlamydia. It's usually not given to other populations besides expectant mothers as there are more uh, effective choices available for those populations. Levofloxin. It's generally not the first line treatment used to heal chlamydia. Taken once daily for seven days, this drug is typically more expensive than other antibacterial medications. Levofloxin may be given to those who have allergies to more commonly prescribed medications for chlamydia. Chlamydia prevention. It's best to avoid sexual contact with those known to be infected with chlamydia. Use condoms to prevent the spread of the infection. Limit the number of sexual partners one has. Tell your partner if you have an STD. Many STDs occur in clusters, and it's not unusual to have more than one STD at a time. And most importantly, get tested for all STDs annually. If you live in the United States, you can call 877-787-4875 to schedule an appointment for confidential STD testing in your area. Thanks for watching.